sight restored while others have been administered with medication to save their sight. This was made possible by the Daybreak Vision Project who conducted free eye surgery for residents in Bolgatanga and its surrounding communities in the Upper East Region. Many patients thronged the Presbyterian Eye Hospital in the Bogotanga municipality for the free surgery after a successful screening exercise at their various communities. Co-founder and chief executive officer of Daybreak Vision Project, Dr. John Welling, says a quarter of a million people in the country are suffering from cataract, especially the aged and vulnerable people in the rural areas who do not have access to health care. He explained that the eye is one of the most important human organs which need to be properly taken care of and advise Ghanaians to regularly check their eyes at health facilities to ensure their eyes are in good condition. But there are also other factors that cause people to get cataracts at an earlier age. This week we've seen an eight-year-old boy, a 13-year-old boy, a young girl. Unfortunately, there's not really anything that can be done to prevent cataracts. It just happens. And so the main thing is awareness understanding that treatment is available and bringing your loved ones to get checked out um, into a place where they can find reliable surgery. At the time GBC News visited, more than 700 patients had already gone through the surgery on either a single eye or both. The country director for Daybreak Vision Project, Dr. Akwesi Ahmed, pointed at the importance of the exercise for the people in areas where there is no single ophthalmologist to attend to patients. Currently in the Upper East Region, there is no ophthalmologist. So it is important that these exercises are conducted to be able to help clear the backlog. We are only scratching the tip of the iceberg, but we believe that with the support of, the, of these uh, NGOs, with the support of the government, we will gradually get there. A patient, Akambiri Alan, was grateful to Daybreak Vision Project and their collaborators for coming to their aid. So it is helpful for a lot of the people who came from so many villages. People came from Sandema, Bongo, Kusasi land and all those areas. They were all here. Daybreak Vision is a non-governmental organization based in the U.S. and collaborated with the Ministry of Health and Ghana Health Service for this project. For GBC News, Peter Gingri, reporting.